Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna cook. I am in the chateau's kitchen with Nick from uh, Legacy of Legends and uh, Gwendolyn and Olivia. <laughs> <laughs> okay. My name is Mo, and welcome to my channel. I am Algerian. Living in France with my girlfriend Saïli and her English family. On this channel, I'm going to share with you my passions. Cooking. Sports. DIY and some daily life. So Mo, what are you doing? What's the what's the process? So today I'm gonna do uh, something called bricks. What or, are, what are they? It's um, a special Algerian uh, dish. Uh, we used to do it during Ramadan, so I'm gonna make it today. It's really it's very delicious. Uh, for that. I need potato, uh, onions, some spinach, olives, uh, of course, garlic. What's in the bag? Uh, this is uh, eschalots. So I'm gonna use some of the shallots and uh, some. This is what we call in French is feuille de brick. Uh, there are some pastry special to do that. I'm gonna show you later. And Gwendolyn is uh, chopping some. Uh, Prawns that we're gonna use, and of course, some cheese and creme fraiche. So, just follow the process for that. Yeah, I forgot something. What have you forgotten? <laughs> yeah, and also, uh, I wanted to do, I tried uh, three days ago, I tried some uh, tartar d'avocat, it's avocado, it's tartar of avocado with avocado, some, uh, with some tomatoes, uh, onion and lemon and it was very delicious so I'm it making again. it today for everybody oh yeah, avocado and uh, I think and then I have some tomato here and some, uh, uh, what is called this? Looks like a very big chili. Yeah, chili. To make some special salad, which called hamis. It's an uh, Algerian one or, uh, also. Okay then, let's go do the work. Let's... Okay, what's going on Mo? So this is for the salad that I, I want to make. Bit with chili, pepper, and some tomato. Mm -hmm. So, why are you cooking them? I'm cooking them so I can take the the skin off and uh, to have some uh, good texture, just like that.
So now I have all the the chili and tomato done like that. As you can see, it's better to do that on barbecue, but just we don't have uh, enough time to do to to prepare barbecue. So I just did it on the on the cooker. Look, when you, when you have this, the skin came off really easily, like that. Really easily. Oh no, this is the way that you take skin from chili or pepper, even you like. We got everything done, tomato and chili and pepper. So now, just cut them all. Voila. Now our salad is done. So this it called hamis, like I said earlier. So now you need just to add salt, like that, and the magic olive oil. then mix it a bit you can also add aubergines is it aubergines Aubergine. in English? Aubergine. yeah aubergine and it's I like aubergines So I think in every Algerian restaurant in all over the world, you can find this kind of salad. It it called hamis, or you can ask for salad mishwiya. It's called salad mishwiya. Just a bit of cutting. Voila. Oh. 
Okay, so to do the break, uh, we need onions. So I have here some eschalots and some red onion that this, I'm gonna use them for the tartar of avocado. So I have here norm a normal onion and a fresh one. So I always use a fresh onion to do the bread because they, they have uh, more flavor and more, they are uh, very soft. The spring onion. Yeah. Uh, we have persil, garlic, cheese, spinach. This is uh, prawns that we cut in the small pieces. We can also use uh, mince and uh, uh, chicken. So today I'm using prawns because I think everybody likes prawns. And here I'm boiling potato that I'm gonna mash later once it's boiled. I'm boiling uh, and um, olives and olives that that already cut. Voila. So. Uh, I need that. Magic stuff. Oh no. I cut the onion. I think we cut a little of time here. It's good. Voila! Look at that, Nick. Look at him go! Voila! Cooking and exercising at the same time. Some eschalots. So now, before I start cooking, I will uh, prepare the tartar of avocado. As you can see, I already cut two avocado, and this is the third one. It's for to do the tartar of avocado. Always, you choose a very soft avocado. Otherwise, you can't you can't uh, make them like uh, mash mash them or something like that. Oh, even take a skin off.
So I just add uh, some pepper, black pepper, and some of lemon to this. And I'm gonna add uh, vin uh, vinegar. I'm gonna add vinegar. But before I do that, because we have some guests that they, that she she don't like vinegar, like white vinegar, so. I'm gonna do her one here and she can put balsamic or some whatever she want voila this is the tartar I put some prawn of olive oil like that voila this is for tiger our guest okay now i can add the the vinegar like that maybe more lemon Voila, this is now done. Now I'm gonna start cooking the bread because everybody uh, is waiting for the bread. Now, Nick, just come this way. Maybe in a minute. It's 
find it would be very small. The, the aim to boil the, the olives is to, is to take off all that salty water and uh, the salty um, taste for, for them. So now they are just olives without any extra taste. Carvey, I don't know what is in English, but it's Carvey in French. I don't know the, just a little bit. Uh, what else? I think, I think everything. That's good. Stir it a bit. Mm. Add the garlic.
then I prepare my, my eggs, fresh one from our chickens. I wash everything. Everything I wash it. So I can try them. Yeah. Now I add the prawns. Sweet chili. I didn't forget it. Oh no. I know they say it on every cooking program, but you've got to smell it. It's good. Yeah. Gonna be like a massive omelette. Mm. No. I think four is enough. And the eggs are just to bind it all together? Yeah. Everything. This is just the preparation and then we need to put, I need to, to mash the potato and mix them and then I will put them in the, that uh, fry the brick mm -hmm. and then we fry them at the, at the end we fry them. I tried them last time in the in the oven, it was okay then. But the best way is to fry them. That was the best one. Voila! This is done. Uh, now the potato. I'm just Alors. for the mashed potato. I put a bit of the butter like that. I put cheese. I put one more cheese. Six. And even if you want to make just mashed potato, make it this way with some butter, some cheese and some cream fish. So, Mr. Mash, the potato, exercise and cooking.
I am adding the creme fresh now because Sadie just take it for me. Now, once it's like that, we add what we cooked earlier. Voila! I'll just give you some neck to taste. How Be is it? Beautiful. Good. Mm. How is it about the, the salt and. No. Is I, it good? Yeah. No. Good. Good, good, good. Voila! Now, I will put them in this stuff, I'm going to show you, so this is voila. so I will put this in this one, in this, and then we fry, we fry them. Okay, that's it. Thank you. 